Hey everybody, welcome back to Near Automata. Uh, Alright, it's been about a day since I played this. Eh, D&D &D night. Basically, the ranger almost got eaten by velociraptors. I almost got eaten by a pterodactyl. You know, D&D. &D. Basically in a, uh, we're in a town... There's a great hunt going on, kind of like the, uh, kind of like the great hunt in Final Fantasy IX and Lindblum, except it's kind of mixed with Jurassic Park. So there's dinosaurs in town. Yeah, shit got real. Luckily, ter luckily, pterodactyls aren't that sturdy. A few magic missiles will bring the fuckers down. Alrighty, so what the fuck was I doing? Heritage of the past. Ah, so... Having rec received mementos of this... So do I have... Do I actually have any? Full on quests? Space materials. Did he actually ever come back? There's no camp maintenance thing there. Okay, I guess we're just heading into the forest zone to go fuck with uh, fuck with stuff out there. Emil, pull the fuck over! Oh, welcome. Why am I running a shop like this? Yeah, it's a really long story you probably don't have time for. So how about you buy something? Okay, so you still sell them the plus threes. Yeah. Alright, I don't need a receipt. Free hand scan 9S. Hope to see you again to B. Okay. Wait, he said to B. Oh, wait, there's a chest over here. Oh, it must be up there. Hey, Bullwinkle. Hmm. 
whatever. Um, I don't know, maybe if I increase my... Hmm. Buddy. How you doing? Looking a little dead there. Oh, hi. Wait a second. Lazor. Oh, whoops. Sorry, Bullwinkle. Yep. As many, uh, what the hello? You know, Pascal never, like, died on camera, so there's still a possibility that, although that quest isn't there anymore, to bring Pascal bits of the old world. The auto item pickup should have just been a thing from the start. I wonder if I can get over there. Oops. chest is over here, or, well, ah! Oh, tree sap. I think I bought a bunch of that, actually. Yeah, I think these are the guys that have the, yeah, these are the guys that have the good shit.
Oh, hey, look. Hmm, but you look for someone who cares deeply about gastronometry. Doing research about food for whatever the human race decides to return to Earth. As humans are always going on about eating, right? Well, also clothing and shelter, but mostly eating. Anyway, I'm collecting ingredients from across the land for research purposes, and I'm betting you'd like to help me out, uh, right? Even though I know all the humans are extinct, sure. Thanks a million, so meat's on the top of the list. Naturally, which means I need to head out and find both moose and boar meat. Moose! Query. Since androids generate energy from water, what purpose does the resistance have with animal protein? Who knows? Maybe it's more of a feeling thing. Like some people just want to eat it every now and then. It appears illogical. Whatever. So androids generate... Huh. So what are... They dividing the atoms, or...? Fuck you, Bullwinkle! I must kill you for dinner! Why am I only getting beast hide? Motherfucker! I'll deal with you momentarily, Boomba. Throw your sword at it. It's dead, Jim. Boomba! Boomba! Or should I call you Mr. Pig? That should do it for the meat. Let's get it to that traitor. So, yeah, are, are, are androids like steam powered? Because this is they generate energy from water. But then again, they blow up rather spectacularly, so, I mean, could it be to cool down a nuclear reactor? A cool down nuclear reactor. One of my fuel cells has ruptured, and then just chuck it out to the side like fucking Terminator 3. Just small hydrogen explosion, just boof. Okay, let's see. Moose meat, boar meat. Yeah, that's everything. I tell you what, you fry this up in, with a little salt and pepper, bam. Taste explosion. Uh, allegedly. Have you ever eaten it before? It's actually pretty popular among resistance combat models. Not that it has much of an effect. Humans were so amazing, weren't they? Just their cooking knowledge alone is enough to blow my mind. But what do you think will happen to us androids once we finally come once they finally come back? I mean, we're built to fight, and if we don't need to do that... Nah, forget it. We've all got our own work to do, right? I'm going to keep up with food research as long as I can. Marine life has returned in force to the oceans and rivers, after all. So, when humans return, I'll make sure to greet them with a glorious feast. See you around. <laughs> do you have another quest? Uh, you must be exhausted from all the terrible things that have happened. Please take care of yourself. I understand how anxious these times must be for you. Go in good health. Mm, okay.
Is that one of our large units? Affirmative. Said unit appears to be delivering something to the giant facility. Hypothesis. This facility may be designed to transport some kind of resource. What's the resource it's transporting? Unknown. For what purpose? Unknown. For what purpose? Unknown. I wonder how that robot... Oh. I was gonna say, I wonder how that one robot off in the, uh... What the animals is doing. Kangaroo root. Buddy, you okay? are gone. Yeah, he probably won batshit psycho. Or he was killed by the machines. I can actually hunt. I'll kill you. I'll kill you. <laughs> That's my line. Like humans now. Thank 
that's just... Alright, this is just the save point. Surrounded by animals! Animals! Oh, hi. Okay. Strange doll. Oh, okay. It was a uh, water, water bed. Ah. 
Eh, that ain't really worth it. No. I'll be with you in a second, big machine thing. Well, it could have been something. I mean, we did find the Dragoon Lance in a large chest like that, after all. Okay, Mr. Defense Mode, what do you got? I got a laser. Is this writing? I can't read it. Analysis. Writing is an ancient language known as angelic. It reads, meat box. Okay then. <laughs> meat box. Gee, I wonder what's in the meat box. It's in the forest. Is it steaming a bunch of meese and boars? Is this entire building made of machines? Even on the inside? Analysis. Many useless parts unrelated to machine lifeform functionality detected. The reason for using said parts is unknown. There's no meaning to anything they do. A bunch of combat arenas? Okay, meat box.
machines can't feel pain. Oh boy, dance floor. Like you just don't care. Materials from the structure itself, possibly useful for creating weapons. Weapons, eh? Prepare energy. Close range firing mode. Maximum output. 9S. Fire. Forest access key. Help me. Select unit to monitor. Hmm. Well, let's check out A2. Affirmative. Commencing support of unit A2. It's probably going to have its own little bits. So then. What happened to command? Number two, go! I can handle- No! Number four! <laughs> I 
Activation of Unit A2 confirmed. Good morning, A2. Who are you? Tactical Support Unit Pod 042. This pod has been tasked with providing firing support for Yorha Unit A2. I didn't ask for help. Affirmative. No request was received from Unit A2. Rather, it was the final order from this pod's previous support assignment, Unit 2B. Well, it's unnecessary. Yorha Unit A2 lacks the authority to override this order. Whatever. What the hell is that huge thing? Unknown. You're pretty useless, you know that? Alright, so... <clears throat> Alright, so you have what she had equipped. Type 3 sword. So those weapons that she had... Hmm. Uh. Oh, wait, no. No, never mind. Yeah, she had the Type 3 sword. I bought those from... At least I think that's what she had. Proposal. Unit A2 should state her intentions. Why the hell would I do that? In order to provide optimal support, pods must be supplied with data relating to the activities of supported units. Not happening. Oh, so she can taunt. Alright, so... Oh, she just fucking... She just vanished. Wait. Proposal. Unit A2 should state her intentions. What did I just say? If an attending support unit is not provided with data related to the activity of its target, it is programmed to automatically repeat the request every 30 seconds until such data is made available. Are you kidding me? Proposal. Unit A2 should state her intentions. Needlessly repeating conversations on the same topic is a waste of energy resources. You're the one who keeps talking. <laughs> Do I have mail? I have mail. <clears throat> mm. Attention all androids. In recent years we've received reports that many peculiar units have been sighted among the machine life forms. We also have heard troubling reports of enemies approaching androids under a so-called banner of peace. Do not let yourselves be deceived. The mission trusted all androids is the utter destruction of the enemy to the very last. Glory to mankind. This is an automated bot. <laughs> Hello there. I'm kind of bored out of my mind over here, so how about swinging by the store? I've got some pretty good stuff on hand. Uh, probably. Hey friend, thanks for stopping by. You into fishing at all for a while? Oh, yeah. To all androids, thousands of years have passed since we humans were driven to the moon. And while the war remains deadlocked, we know that our continued safety is only possible thanks to your valued efforts on the ground. We ask that you continue giving your all to the mission of recapturing Earth from the scourge of the machines. This is an automated message. Yeah, 
Special all, all androids. Uh, correspondence. We have received words of the recent destruction of Adam and Eve. The enemy life were in central networking units with the enemy weakened. Now's our moment. I think these are old. As you're aware, recent. Okay, yeah, these are old. Why does she. Eh. So Emil's store should be updated. Ah, uh, yes. I have a heavy attack again. is to beat the hell out of every goddamn machine I can find. Is that enough for you? Affirmative. Scanning and marking of nearby machine life forms complete. Goliath class enemies detected in desert area. Proposal. Goliath class enemies should be destroyed. Don't tell me what to do. Pods are not authorized to issue commands. Proposals are merely recommendations based on data provided by Unit A2. Proposal. Unit A2 should state updated intentions in order to secure more usable data. Shut. The. Hell. Up. Negative. This pod is engaging in activity based on the final order of Unit 2B. Your high Unit A2 lacks the authority to issue commands. Look, just stay out of my way. Affirmative. I think she does. I think she just does more damage. Welcome. Oh, hello. I need dented sockets. I need more dented sockets just to make sure I don't have to get more dent more dented sockets later. There are still a lot of weapons to find. Fuck it. Because I don't know how many of these I might need. I'm just going to make sure I get, like, at least 50 of them. Now. So if I hold dash, she does this little... She's also pissed off. It sounds like she's pissed off a lot of the time, so... Kind of reminds me of Kaine. Kaine would also be the kind who would fucking taunt her enemies. Actually, well... It wasn't really taunting, it was more along the lines of, I'm going to rip your eyes out of their and piss in their sockets. Things along the, that nature. She was a fun one to be around. Going into battle and, you know, her lingerie and jockstrap. Because, yeah, I mean, eh. There was a glitch in the system and her replicant got born as a hermaphrodite, so of course all the primitive replicants were like, You're a freak! And then the old grandmother raised her was like, You're a bunch of assholes, I'm gonna kick your ass! And she was raised by a cussed old lady. You're a two. 
Never mind, just be careful out there, yeah? You, if you all in one piece, there weren't many casualties in this area, but we might not be so lucky next time. So then, what can I do you for? Let's get some of these. Fuck the down attack, fuck the crit. I have level 6 shockwave, fuck that, fuck this, I'll hold on to that. I have maxed out Deedly Heal, I have auto... Uh. Yeah, I have auto heal six. I don't need auto heal these. I think I have. Yeah, I have drop rate. Oh no, I took my drop rate off. Stun six. To the desert of tripping. And by tripping, I mean actually like tripping, tripping, not tripping balls. So there's an item over. You want to dance? Actually, I think I might have taken off my. I think I actually might have taken off the uh, the offensive heal just to keep the deadly heal. So I ain't gonna be able to hack it, hack through any bullshit doors with her.
got? For Goliath class. That was over before it started. Negative. Enemy machines remain in the area. <laughs> oh, hi. What the hell is that? A boss. It appears to be a machine life form that has adapted to the desert environment. Proposal. Destroy the enemy machine. Yeah, that's real helpful. He's tough. Time to bust out B mode. Alert. The use of B mode to increase nuclear fusion output carries unacceptable levels of risk. And the offensive boost is offset by lower defense and increased maintenance costs. The feature was removed from newer models for this reason. Guess it's too bad I'm not a newer model. I have Berserk mode. Fuck's sake. Hey, do you want to go in fucking defense mode? Well, too bad. What's all this 
this about? The hacking has caused the enemy's memories to merge with your own. You and I are the same. We have no one to help us. We can only cry I and said scream. Shut up! Conversation mode complete. Affirmative. Awaiting report on the effects of Unit 2B's memory data on Unit A2's self-consciousness. Understood. Updating as reference data for support activity. Hmm. No. Oh. They basically like play a little scenario here and there. Uh, well, anyway, that's it for this episode. When we come back, uh, maybe we'll keep an eye on A2 a little bit longer. Adios.